Now that we've deployed a test contract and token, I'd say we're ready to go to the mainnet. If you'd like to make changes, feel free to do so by clicking this Edit Contract button. You'll head back over to the Edit Contract screen. Note that if you've minted test tokens, you'll need to delete these tokens before redeploying to mainnet. But let's say we're okay with everything. So one final thing to check before deploying to mainnet is deciding which wallet you want to deploy this contract from. The use case here is if you've signed up for Manifold with a hot wallet and would like to deploy using something like a ledger, you can make that switch here. But in this demo, I'm going to use this current wallet. Okay, I think we're all set. So let's go ahead and click deploy on mainnet. Now, after the transaction is signed in MetaMask, the contract will become immutable. So changes to the contract name, the contract type and symbol, as well as the ASCII art cannot be edited. But we're okay with everything, so LFG. Great, so now we have the MetaMask notification pop up. If this price is too expensive, feel free to reject the transaction and try this again later. But I think we're okay with this for now. So let's go ahead and hit confirm. So once this is running, it'll take about five to 10 minutes to deploy and then verify your contract. We're just gonna do a little bit of fast forwarding here while this verifies. Congratulations, the contract is deployed on mainnet. Let's go ahead and take a look on Etherscan. So here we are on Etherscan. This is the address to the contract. We have the contract title. We have the contract symbol. And if we click over here, we have the ASCII art. So in our next video, let's go ahead and mint a token to the mainnet.